Branches of Hope, the 9-11 Survivor Tree. Written by Anne McGee and illustrated by Nicole Wong. Bright sun streamed down onto the busy New York City streets and the tree basked in the warmth. Until something unthinkable happened. The sky roared and exploded. Fire rained down, down, down. Sidewalks rumbled, buildings crumbled. Great black clouds billowed all around the tree. Silence. Then sirens wailed. Time passed slowly. Buried in darkness, the tree reached up, longing for the light. Weeks later, a rescue worker spotted something green among the ashes, a sign of ongoing life. The tree dug its roots deep into rich soil again. Burned bark, like scars, covered the tree. Winter came and the tree slept. Thousands of volunteers and city workers dug through debris, day after day, month after month, at the tree's old home. It was known as Ground Zero. People all around the world lit candles and prayed for peace. Season after season, the tree grew. Each spring arrived with warm whispers and healing rain. The tree breathed. White star-like flowers adorned its branches again. Leaders planned memorials for those who lost their lives. Families went to baseball games and celebrated birthdays. In summer, the tree revealed a dense canopy of leaves. Birds built nests. The tree grew taller, smooth bark emerging from the rough. Workers constructed a museum and planted new trees in rows, like soldiers. People hung American flags and marched in parades. Cool autumn air brought other changes for the tree. Colors of sunsets gilded the tree's leaves. Bronze leaves, like flames, fell. Children chased fireflies and attended first days of school. A decade had passed and it was time for the tree to go back home. Bright sun streamed down onto busy New York City streets. People stood shoulder to shoulder in the warmth, holding hands and remembering. Tears rained down, down, down. Voices sang loud and strong. The tree reached its branches toward the light. Growing stronger every day, 